Good afternoon everyone, welcome to our video live tour of this studio flat in Knights Court on Ufton Lane to rent in Sittingbourne. This is currently up for £650 per calendar month. So we are just starting inside the flat in the uh, hallway here. Just a few bits to go over. If this is your first live tour with us, um, you do have a little box on your screen to ask me any questions. If you need me to look at anything again, pop me a note. And if there are any internet issues at all, if you please let us know, this will be recorded so we can send it to you afterwards, so not to worry. So this is your entrance or hallway here. To the side, you've got your fuse boxes, consumer units. And then you've also got a radiator in here as well. So it's all electric in the apartment. This is your bathroom area. So you've got sink, toilet, and then also your shower there. So it is an electric shower. And you do have a little side bit there for like shampoo bottles. Also a towel rack. And just above, like a little uh, like heater extractor there to help with the condensation. So that's your bathroom. Spinning around now, so this is sort of your main living space here. And then you've also got your bedroom sort of curtained off for a bit of extra privacy, which is quite nice. So this is the space here. We've also got these nice large windows as well, letting in lots of natural light. And these take you out onto Ufton Lane. There. So this is the, the sort of the bedroom space here, just behind the curtains. And overall it is quite a decent space. In here, so this is just like a little utility cupboard. So you've got a few shelves in there, just for a little bit of storage for the little bits and bobs to hide away. And then you've got your kitchen as well. So the kitchen's sort of a little bit blocked off, so it's not all in one space, which is quite nice. It's all got a little bit more separated, a bit more structure. So this is your kitchen. So again, quite a decent sized kitchen. So you've got your oven and hob there with the extractor just above. And quite a few cabinets as well. So you do have quite a decent bit of storage even though it is only a smaller space. That is your sink. And, yeah. and then also just underneath, you've got space for your washing machine as well. So it doesn't come included, you'll have to provide your own. So that is the kitchen space there. And then again, another little heater there to help with any condensation. And also another window in the kitchen too. So that's the inside of the, um, the flat cupboard, quite quick and easy. I will also go outside and show you the, uh, like the parking for the property as well in case you're unaware. But if you did have any questions for me, if you just pop them into the comments section now and then we can go over them before we do leave. <clears throat> so this, I'm standing in like the bedroom area, looking out to the kitchen. So it doesn't come with a fridge and um, fridge freezer in here. So you do have a plug socket here where the bin is. So it would probably be easiest to get it slotted in there, the fridge freezer, just along that wall in the corner. And it doesn't come included with a washing machine, but again, you do have space under the work surface. So the white goods you will have to provide yourself, but there is space for them. And that's in the kitchen. And there is also like a wall mount already on the wall for TVs, which is quite handy. Save space on any TV units. You can just pop it on the wall. <clears throat> if you did have any questions for me whilst we're inside, please pop them in before we head downstairs. But this is your bathroom again. So medicine, cabinet, sink and toilet. And then your 
shower. Yeah. Okay. So what we're going to do now is that's the inside, so there's no new questions coming through. So we're just going to go through the communal areas downstairs to the, the parking area, just so I can show you where that is to make you aware. So in terms of applications, how it will work with those, um, I'll explain this just before we go downstairs because it's quite windy, so just in case you can't hear me. After I end the live tour today, you'll be sent a text message which will have a link to an application form. So if you did want one, it will be sent to you straight after this by text. All you need to do is just click on the link in the text and then that will take you to the form to complete for us. Um, and then we can put all of your details over to the owner of the property. So that's how the application stage does work. Again, we can resend those manually, those applications. So if you do have any issues, of course, let one of us know and we can send them over. So that's just an insight to how the applications work. But what we'll do now is we'll just head downstairs and show you the communal areas. So we're just heading down. There's six flats in total in the block. And as you come in, there's a little notice board there. 